City Police Chief Abram Kanime has alerted citizens with regards to concerns of a black market that has come to light. The suspects were caught in connection with owning shops that are known for cracking and wiping digital codes from stolen items such as cell phones and laptops. We have now three cases or three areas of concern now. As you can see from one to number eight, these are the gangsters that are terrorizing the area of uh, Horeanghab and Hakahana on cell phone grabbing. We have been monitoring them all along, and now we came to the point of um, arresting them. They are operating especially in the, uh, in, in the corner of Machichi and uh, Monte Cristo. These people know that these guys are the one committing crime. So what we are going to do is uh, to go and work with the community leader and the community so that, and also introduce them to the community so that the community can keep an eye on. The other group, these are the people that are buying stolen items. Yesterday we have a case where a laptop, a, a laptop was stolen from a car at uh, Marua Mall. Using our operational methods, we trace it up to the shops of owned by these people. Means that they are the one buying. And uh, even they went to an extent of uh, flushing the old information out of that laptop. Kanima further said that his office will reach out to the courts for the suspects to be denied bail and to remain in custody as they are regular offenders of the same crime. We are ups, up in arms against this criminal. And the message that I'm sending is they better stop or they will face it. I will send our officers, the investigator from Nampol and that of the city police, the gangs are pressures, will make sure that they convince the court for these people not to be given bail. Uh, because 99% of those people that are committing crime here in Windhoek, they are out of bail. Like uh, in, 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 his, uh, in, in, in the case, the one who stole, although he's not here, he's already in custody. Yesterday he was at court and he was acquitted on a case because the tourists that he robbed are in South Africa and they find it difficult for them to come back. So then um, while he was still on bail, because he committed that crime the day before yesterday, he still go and stole a bag of a tourist, consists of a camera and other private documents. The public is warned to avoid purchasing stolen goods in the black market as one can get arrested for being in possession of stolen items. Yeah.